So how was your day? The heavy bag and I spent some quality time together. How was your day? Not so great. I hate the way this feels between us, Carla. But I'm at a loss. Can we find our way forward or, or is this the end for us? Good thing you kept your day job now that you've printed your first and last issue of Crimson. I may have said some things that I didn't mean at the office, you know. I know I did. I missed you last night. I missed you too. I've been missing you for a while now. I'm not the same since prison. I've been hearing that a lot lately, but if you're looking for the man that I used to be, he's gone for good. I don't have a firm grasp on the old Drew or the man that I am now for that matter. Drew Kane is good and kind and funny and sweet and so decent. It's the man I fell for. Sounds interesting. I could spend the rest of my life getting to know him and never scratch the surface and love every minute. Because I love you. And I'm not the only one. Scout adores you because you're such an amazing father. And you risked everything, including your life, to save Willow. And my God, when we were both facing the possibility of going to prison. You stood up and you took the blame for everything and it cost you so much. There was no other choice. Yes, there was. Lesser men make easy, self-serving choices every day, but not you, not ever. I feel like there's a but coming. It must be so hard to be such a good man and move through the world the way you do. And I love you so much. I want you to put Pentonville in the past behind you. Believe me, I want to put Pentonville behind me too. I just don't know how that's even possible because I can't ignore what Nina did to me. You have every right to hate Nina. I hate her too. But I don't have the bandwidth to care about her. She's not worth it. But you are, and I care so much about you, and I, I care, care about us. I care about us too. But I... I told you before, I don't see how this relationship works if you can't let go. Have you? I mean, really, because I don't remember twisting your arm to get you to take over for Nina at Crimson. What are you talking about? I only took that job because you asked me to. I did it for you. Yeah, but admit it, you enjoyed seeing Nina lose something that she loved. Oh my God, I freely admit it. I love taking over something that Nina had and making it better. But I didn't stop there for you. You kept finding ways to get back at Nina and that's when I knew I couldn't stay at Crimson. I mean, this place, this place was named in honor of a woman who gave as good as she got. She knew not to chase revenge. My mom never gave in to her worst impulses. She rose above them and that's what I'm trying so hard to do. And underneath all the wrongs that Nina has piled on top of you, I know that Drew Kane is in here. I know that he is and I see it and I need you to see it and I need you to own it. Or else... <sighs> or else what? Or else Nina wins.